Hello, Spider fans and college football fans everywhere. It's Sashmo with the Spider Gang and a couple of special guests, Spider Girl and Spider Boy. Richmond fans, that was 2015, a very long time ago. But those Thanksgiving playoff times have returned, and we've got a lot to be thankful for. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody, and hello, Spider fans everywhere and college football fans across America and around the world. It's Satchmo from the Spider Gang. Grateful to be back for a special FCS Playoffs episode of Spider's Prologue. It features the Davidson Wildcats who come to the Brick House on Saturday to face Richmond in the first round of the playoffs. Kickoff is slated for 2 p.m. Spider fans, I don't know about you, but I had some anxious moments waiting for the Spiders to show up in that last empty box of the selection show. But after six long years, it was worth the wait. And it was good to see an old Southern Conference and A-10 member Davidson show up as a first-round opponent and then to top that off with a home game at the Brickhouse. When the dust had settled on the brackets and the football pundits began to speak, it became clear that most believed the Spiders got a good draw in the first round. Davidson plays football in the Pioneer League, which is generally considered to be a weaker FCS league than the Colonial. The schedule the Wildcats play includes teams you may not have heard of and even teams that are not Division I. But you know what, Spider fans? The Wildcats won eight games just like Richmond. They earned the Pioneer League auto bid. They run an offense that's pretty unusual in college football today. It's the triple option and the rushing stats they piled up in their wins are impressive. Davidson scores a lot of points. Now, no doubt, just like Richmond, Davidson had a goal at the beginning of the season and they achieved it through hard work and execution on the field. I'm sure they're confident and motivated, and the Wildcats could bring a little something extra to the Brickhouse. A special motivation that comes along with being a three-touchdown underdog. You heard that right, Spider fans. Earlier this week, I read Richmond had been made a 24-point favorite by the professionals. That spread was easily the largest of any first round FCS playoff game. I expect it was fertilizer for the Wildcats, perfect for growing that proverbial chip on their shoulder when they suit up on Saturday. Now that the Spiders have earned their playoff spot, their challenge will be to do something with it. That starts Saturday against a Davidson team that will come to the brick house with nothing to lose, something to prove, and an offense that is difficult to prepare for. We better be ready. If we are mentally ready for Davidson, we should be able to execute on the field. If we execute on the field Saturday, we should have enough to defeat the Wildcats. I just can't imagine the Spiders not advancing to the second round. This is the opportunity that brought most of these guys to play at Richmond. It took years to prepare for this challenge and months of hard work to get to this day. Don't let the goal slip away. Speaking of thankful, the Crazy Spider Gang Predictions Contest ended last weekend with a truly shocking outcome. The 2022 champion is yours truly, Satchmo. After 12 undistinguished and frustrating years, I finally won the coveted championship and iconic trophy. 
Anybody think this was a good omen for the spiders? So spider fans, wherever you are Saturday, make another turkey sandwich and send your good mojo towards a brick house and be thankful we've still got football to play. That's all for Davidson. No California dreaming till this work is done. Go Spiders. So long for now.